What's going on guys? It's Trey Mathis here from warfareentrepreneur.com. So glad to see you guys landing here on my page today. It's another beautiful day here in Brookville, Maryland. Today I'm in Brookville, Maryland. I'm excited to talk with you guys today a little bit about investing, share with you guys some stuff that's happened to me over the last uh, 24 hours, catch you guys up on what's been going on. So let's go ahead and get started. This is the Wi-Fi Journal. Hey guys, if this is your first time checking us out, and this is on Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube, make sure you subscribe to our channels. We're here to help you turn your passion into profit and earn income online. As I shared with you guys before, I'm here hanging out in Brookville, Maryland, and actually this house is pretty historic. It's known for, has a great history, actually. It's really known for its mill. It has an old wool mill where the river would churn away uh, to spin this, this old school wheel. And uh, old school mill, do they call it a milling wheel? I think they call it a milling wheel. And uh, from there, they would then in turn produce uh, uniforms. They would produce sheets, clothes, anything that the area needed at that time, uh, 18th century, maybe. It's pretty old. Um, it's a pretty old house, and it's pretty awesome. It has a few ghosts remain inside the house. Uh, we share the house with others. Uh, nothing too spooky, but, you know, if you believe in that kind of stuff, then it's there for you uh, to buy into. <laughs> uh, last 48 hours, a couple things happened for me. Uh, the first thing is I realized the value of having pre-curated content or having content shot in advance. It's been a, a tremendous benefit because I felt like I hit a, a, uh, a sticking point in which I didn't feel like I really wanted to do it anymore. I didn't want to shoot any more videos. I figured, you know, I have enough content. This is the content should, should do what I'm looking to do. But I had to reassess what it was I was trying to accomplish and understanding that uh, helping people learn uh, how to turn their passion to profit, helping people learn from my mistakes, I have to be able to share more. And one of the things that I could share is that I was thinking about quitting. I was being burnt out. Uh, but I reassessed, like I said, my goals, and here I am shooting another video. So it was really awesome that I had content ahead of time to continue to post, to get me past those two days of, I don't know, whatever you wanna call it, just two days of break that I really needed. So uh, hopefully you guys can understand that, that having content in advance is a benefit so therefore whenever you reach a, a tough spot you can continue pushing because you've already planned ahead <laughs> that's pretty good actually uh, because oftentimes that's what it takes to be a survivor is that planning ahead so that for when something were to happen you are protected and you're you've already thought about the, the situation even if you wasn't aware that when you're in the situation like this is the situation this is why you did it but it's, it just kind of works out that way which leads me to my second thing that's happened in the last 48 hours i got a call from my good buddy a uh, partner of mine in another business and he reached out to me about uh, an investing opportunity and it's gonna be pretty awesome it's gonna give us an opportunity to get in some key investments uh, early on as they're being developed as a uh, like private equity to get involved in a private equity space and um, the funny thing about being involved in a private equity space is the amount of capital that's usually needed in order to get involved the amount of money that you need to uh, bring to the table if you want to get in some of these cutting-edge investments. I remember one of the 
last videos I shot here in Brookville, I actually was talking about how to utilize a dollar, you know, how to save and make sure that you're using your money wisely, you're investing uh, not only in yourself, in your current business like wifientrepreneur.com, but you're also putting away money that can allow you to be prepared any event another opportunity came about for a bigger and better investment that could multiply the success that you're trying to achieve and what's so funny my buddy called me and uh, he says look I got this this opportunity that we can be involved in long term but it's gonna cost you a pretty penny uh, not only this time but a few more times down the line if we really want to see this thing through in 2019 and <laughs> the first thing I thought about was, this is awesome. Of course I want to be involved. Second thing I thought about was, do I have the finances in order to accomplish that? And then the third thing I thought about was the video that I shot here and realized that yes, this is exactly what you've been planning for. So this opportunity that has just came to you uh, and this investment opportunity that just came to you is exactly what you've been telling people to be prepared for, uh, what you've been stashed in a way to be prepared for. Now it's finally here. So uh, I just think that those two lessons that I picked up today in the last 48 hours were really uh, eye opening for me. Uh, creating the content in advance so that you are always to keep up with your strategy. Whatever your strategy is, make sure you plan ahead so that you have what you need in case of emergency. And the second one, uh, making sure that you're investing correctly so that when those big opportunities come by, you're not screaming, I'm broke, I can't be involved, you're prepared. So preparation is the key in all things we've talked about here on wifientrepreneur.com, personal development, to keep preparation just for what life gives you so you always need to be rooted in a good personal development strategy or program and you want to be prepared with your business you want to have an opportunity uh, to generate a, a second income uh, that can protect you in case of uh, financial struggles or layoff or something like that uh, you want to be prepared so uh, I think I'm gonna have to call this one being prepared <laughs> It's worked out for me, guys. I know it's going to work out for you. Look forward to talking with you guys on the next video, which will be real soon. So until we talk again, take care and be blessed.